What's good YouTube? So I just put out two fitness videos, but remember I wanted to not limit this channel to just fitness. So today I'm gonna take you guys through a tour of UC Irvine. graduated a year ago how are you still relevant well with me today I have hi my name is Ellen and if you don't know me I am the census winner of this year and yeah I'm a third year here me with my alumni experience and Ellen with her current UCI experience we're gonna make sure you guys know exactly how to survive through UC Irvine so we're on Ring Road right now and you could wait until you actually come to UCI to take a tour with one of the people that take you on the tours going backwards across campus or you can stick around during this video and tour the campus with us. So we're going to take you through housing, lecture halls, libraries, Aldrich Park, and food. So we're at one of the biggest lecture halls on campus and that's Social Sciences Lecture Hall. There's a class going on right now, but that's perfect. You'll see exactly what classes at UCI look like. I have no idea what class this is, but this is what classes at UCI look like. And Schleckman said no. Fateful decision. So the first thing, they all weren't trying the same case. That's the first 10 minutes. Classes at UCI have lectures one, two, or three times per week. If you have a lecture once per week, expect to spend three hours sitting down in that class. If you have a lecture twice a week, that's about an hour and a half for the lecture. And if you have classes three times per week, expect to have one hour lectures three times a week. Every time I went to a lecture, I would just fall asleep. But what I did was, when it was lecture time, I would pull out my textbook at home and just read at home and learn on my own. But what do you do? So in classes, I actually handwrite everything. Um, I'm a cog sign major, so what they tell me is that writing down your notes is actually more effective than just typing out all your notes. Oh yeah, some professors are super old school and don't let you use any form of technology. And I can't blame them because when I was using my laptop, I would just be texting or something. <laughs> it's true, you like, you'll end up on Facebook or something. In addition to lectures, there's discussions. Discussions usually happen one times per week. I think some classes may have two discussions per week. Don't quote me on that, but one for sure. Some classes don't have any discussions at all. Do know that some discussions are mandatory, whereas others are optional. And I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys here. I didn't go to discussion that much because as the name states, it's called discussion and I never really studied. So with that being said, I had nothing to discuss. It was like discussion time for me was study time. We're here at Langston Library, but there are a few other spots to study on campus, and those are... So right across from Langston Library is Gateway Study Center, and that place is usually packed during like finals and midterms week because it's a great place to study at, and it opens really late. <laughs> Give you a super quick tour before we get kicked out or in trouble. No This is Aldridge Park. Aldridge Park may seem confusing at first, like you might get lost, but I guarantee you it is the fastest way to get to any class, like it'll take 10 to 15 minutes max. And usually a lot of big events are held here, like Summerlands, um, Aldridge After Dark, 
the cool thing about Aldridge Park or UCI in general is you can't really get lost here. Everything is literally in a circle. So if you do find yourself lost, just follow the circle and you'll be all good. There are two freshman housing on campus. This is Middle Earth. This is an example of what Middle Earth housing looks like. And this is Pippin's. Alright, so we're walking outside of Pippin's. We had footage in there, but we have no clearance to record it, so we have to cut it. So I'm sorry guys, we can't show you what Pippin's looks like. During my time here at UCI, Pippin's was the best commons. Next to Pippin's is... Brandywine. And once again, thanks to UCI's strict filming policy, no footage there either. On to Mesa Court! I'm on this new bridge right now. This bridge connects Mesa Court to campus. This this bridge did not exist when I was here at UCI. This is Amanda, guys, and she's a freshman here at UCI. So Amanda, coming into UCI, what were you expecting of dorm life and how's it different now that you're here? To be honest, I thought dorm life was gonna be like really difficult to get used to because I'm not used to like living with like other people like, in the same room as me. But, you know, being here for actually more than a week and stuff, um, I, I find it pretty comfortable and, like, you know, at least I have someone to talk to and, I mean, overall, I think it's a great experience. Alright guys, so we're here at Mesa Court right now and I thought this was going to be really, really boring, but I ran into some awesome people. Hi! Hey! So they're going to take us inside and I'm going to try to get some footage without us getting kicked out. Let's do this! <laughs> So once again, we actually can't go in, but here's a quick glance. This is the all new Ant Eatery, or Eatery, or Commons at Mesa Court. Look at this line, this is crazy. <laughs> so even though we couldn't go inside, like just judging by the line, this place is popping. So unfair. I oh know, my god. Right? So, if you don't like cafeteria food, there are random food courts across campus, such as this one, that have different chain restaurants, such as Subways, Wahoos, Wendy's, and all the above. Now, if you really despise every single food on campus, like you just hate cafeteria food, you I'm hate the food here. over there, there's this nice place across the bridge back there, University Town Center. Here, you're gonna find Chipotle, uh, Chow for Tea, Chick-fil-A, Chick no, uh, Blaze Pizza, uh, Taco Bell, uh, in and out. Oh, Ooh. can't miss that. There's one thing that UCI does better than any other place, any other campus. It's food. I literally feel like we are the food capital of Southern California. <laughs> like, can you can you back me up here on that? Actually, like if you go on like any like source or something, they say Irvine is like best dressed and it has like the best food. This is just UTC. This is the little like university food court right across campus. This isn't even the rest of Irvine. And Irvine is around Tustin, Westminster, and a few other places. So once you have a car and you can actually drive around, you literally have access to every single food place imaginable. But yeah guys, thanks for joining us on our little tour of UCI today. What do you think of this new hall? Um, it's just really unfair because you we never got to experience any of this. And we still can't, really. <laughs> we still can't. And we can't we, film. We tried to get you guys in there, but 
we just can't get in there, literally. We can't film, we can't go in there, we can't do anything. So you're just gonna have to enjoy this really awesome view of the building back there. Like, how, how cool is that? But seriously, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash the like button for me. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe. I think the button's over here, did I get it right? Big thanks to Ellen for coming out and helping me record this video because it was super hard going around, trying to get ideas and just basically record everywhere. If you guys want to follow Ellen, her Instagram is... This. <laughs> and link. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, yeah you do. do. And this is going to be her YouTube channel. Also, um, I'll be performing, um, so stay tuned. I think I'll be performing at Homecoming this year. And like I think another national anthem. So just, just stay tuned and I'll like post everything on my yeah, so if you want to follow Ellen, in case you didn't get the links, I'm going to leave it in the box below. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Bye. Oh, yeah, Ellen sings. Sing for us real quick. Give us a sample. <laughs> or else no one will go. Mm, <laughs> no, check no, it out for no, yourself. No, no, give us a sample. <laughs> like, like a three-second teaser. A sample? Okay. Um, 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 what song should I sing? Oh, uh, the anthem? I don't know. <laughs> the Your anthem? favorite song. Almost is never enough. That's not even fair. <laughs> <laughs>